Hi everyone, my name is Andy Linham and I'm a Strategy Manager for Vodafone Group. Today, I'm going to be talking to you about a new concept called SASE. SASE is the Secure Access Service Edge, which is a new security framework introduced by Gartner. At its most basic level, SASE is about bringing security enforcement closer to the user and applying all of the necessary security policies and protections as early in the traffic path as possible. It looks to improve upon existing security architectures in a number of ways. First, by standardizing security capabilities across an entire organization, working from the edge in and not the other way around. Secondly, by eliminating weak spots in the architecture. And these are particularly those that are associated with remote access and the lack of enforcement once a user gets inside that secure perimeter. The third benefit is visibility of traffic is greatly improved because all the traffic is now monitored, even if it's heading from a remote user through to a public cloud service without touching the organization's boundaries at all. And fourth, by improving that user experience through a reduction in time that it takes to get them to the information that they need to talk to. Now, let's start by looking at a traditional security architecture. We can see here we've got a user on the left-hand side who's accessing corporate information on the right-hand side. They cross a network, either the internet or a private network, and they go through some security enforcement functions such as firewalls or intrusion detection, and they're finally granted access to their applications. It's a simple architecture, and it's been the same approach that's been used for years. We've tended to do it this way as an industry because it allows us to save money by focusing on protecting that which matters most to us. It does have some significant challenges though, mainly brought around by changes in the way that we're working today. There are now more remote users, there are more internet-based workloads, and there are orders of magnitude more information that needs to be protected. This means we need a more cost-effective way of delivering security to more and more locations. And this is where SASE comes in. SASE replaces traditional approaches with an inline all-in-one security service. It enforces security policy against the user's traffic as quickly as it can. This is made possible by the evolution of multi-access edge computing, which allows us to put our compute functions much closer to the user and it significantly reduces the latency of the round trip. Now the users target the nearest available edge node where their sessions can be authenticated. They will be verified by the SASE platform and, assuming that they're authorized, they'll cross whichever is the most appropriate network to get them to their destination. Now all of this means that we can perform more functions in the same amount of time and we can deliver a more secure access method for our users. So what's actually going to be in a SASE deployment? Well, it will include functions like cloud access security brokers, data loss prevention servers, DNS protection, firewall as a service, secure web gateways, remote access virtual private networks and zero trust network access. Now, don't worry, these are all types of security applications that look at a range of threats associated with different types of traffic. They all work together at each edge location to provide a holistic approach to network access. Every transaction is inspected, every file is scanned, and every information exchange is going to be logged. Now, the intensity of the security enforcement is one of the key reasons why the components need to be as close to the user as possible, and they have to work together seamlessly. In fact, Gartner recommend that all the functions you take in your SASE platform come from a single vendor and that they've been designed from the ground up to work together. This is easily the best way to minimize the impact of the user, keeping them safe. Interestingly, vendors have now begun to align themselves with Gartner's vision. And these companies include Cisco, Fortinet, and Zscaler. So, in summary, SASE is a security framework conceived by Gartner to simplify and solidify the security of an organization. It does this through an edge-based collection of network functions that provide a holistic security perimeter wherever it's needed. That's it. Thanks very much for watching.